Anytime a police chief gets a call at 2 in the morning, she knows it's nothing good. I caught up with Phoenix Police Chief Jerry Williams a few minutes ago, and I asked her about this horrific situation. There's speculation, and, and I'd like you to address this, that when you bring a baby out and then shots ring out, that sounds like an ambush. So I will say this, the officer, the first approaching officer who went never knew what was coming. I will say this, the four officers that went in to grab the baby never knew what was coming. Um, and I said earlier today, you know, I'm, I'm trying to maintain my composure as a police chief because I'm supposed to, but, but I'm so angry because these kind of things shouldn't happen. All they're trying to do is come in and answer a call for service of someone who's been shot in our community. So when you're having the worst day of your life, you want to see a blue shoot show up. You don't want to have those officers shot and to have nine shot at one time. In my history and my memory, I can't remember that we've ever had this many officers shot. Any police officer will tell you that one of the worst calls you can go on is a domestic violence call. Phoenix Mayor Kate Gallego also expressed frustration at today's ambush, saying she really can't remember a time when so many Phoenix police officers were injured. The mayor echoing a sentiment from many people, expressing gratitude that officers were there to help and that a baby tonight is safe because of their heroic action. She explained what one of the injured officers told her earlier this morning. Today at the hospital, I was talking to an officer who was about to go into surgery. That officer only wanted to hear about the rest of the squad and how they were doing. That is the type of incredibly selfless individual who serves the city of Phoenix. Now, this incident is getting attention all across the country, not only because of the number of officers who were hurt, but because this appears to be a national trend right now.